What's something small you can start doing today to better yourself? Don't hit the snooze button. The hardest part of getting up is sitting up. Move and yell keep going. Edit, thanks for the gold kind stranger. And my first silver. Yippee. Forgive yourself for not starting yesterday. I used to be addicted to soda, and drank an unhealthy amount. Now I just drink water all day, and occasionally have soda as a treat now and then. I feel a lot better and less groggy without all the soda. Edit, thanks for the gold, silver, and all the upvotes. Who knew a post about me kicking a bad habit would get so much attention? Give someone else a compliment at least once a day. It's as simple as noticing the guy next to you has a stylish tie or that your co-worker's homemade lunch looks tasty. Besides, it always seems to end up making someone's day and the effort required is so, so small. Edit, I'm so proud that this is my most upvoted comment ever and thanks for the gold. Brush your teeth twice a day. It is incredibly important you keep good dental hygiene. If it takes less than a few minutes to do and you're doing absolutely nothing, do it. Write down the stuff you've been putting off and schedule yourself time specifically to get them done. It will keep your mind free from having to constantly remind yourself, and once the task is completed, you're free. Start putting $20 away from each paycheck into a savings account. Don't look at that money. Don't touch that money. That money may as well not exist. Repeat every paycheck, bumping it up as opportunity affords you. Get at least 30 minutes of exercise a day. As simple as taking a walk. Clean your house or room. At the very least just what you can see. It is the only way I can get out of a rut. Thanks for gold, my first ever. I have a horribly anxious mind. Just tidying up helps me move on to the next step. Make more time to hang out with my friends and be there for them. Pick an interesting sounding book. Read it for a few minutes a day. Just try and be nicer to people. Don't fake it just general niceness. Put that positive shit out there and it will follow. Edit, wow this is a really great post top. Gold everywhere and everybody is happy haha. -ha. Working out more often. I'm really bad with that. Forgive your past self and learn from your previous mistakes. Also you can improve others lives by saying thanks, it goes a long way. Put moisturizer with some SPF on your face. Edit, yes, even in winter. Yes, even if you're darker skinned. Y'all are jumping right over the word moisturizer. Take a break from screens every so often. I work in front of a computer so I know my terrible eyes are only going to get worse. Anything I can do to help them I will. Spend 5 minutes picking up the room you are in. Do that 2 or 3 times a day and eventually you'll get into the habit and keeping things clean. Hashtag X200B Edit thanks to whoever gave me gold, spreading the positive vibes my boy hashtag x200b, second edit, completely rearranged my room, still got a bit of cleaning left to do but it feels great walking into my room now. Feels like I'm in a new room all over again. Very refreshing. Hashtag x200b, third edit, this is the kind of vibes we need leading into the new year. I hope for the best for you guys next year and may many blessing be in store for you guys. Also, get to cleaning boys and girls. Smile. Start your day with some stretching exercises. Also happy cake day, de-edit. I went to bed last night with 4k karma and woke up to this, Jesus gifts, thank you, D. Start by writing down a goal. Then make a list of smaller achievable milestones on the way to reaching the goal. Make a budget and stick to it. It can change your life dramatically for the better. Start doing simple exercises that don't require any equipment. Walking running outside, push-ups, sit-ups. Edit, 
I guess not really simple, as most of them require a certain technique so you don't hurt yourself in the long run. But it doesn't cost money, it's something you can do at home if you don't have the time to go to the gym, or combine going to the gym with exercises at home. Good luck to anyone trying something like this. There is a good link in the replies here to a useful website about this. Link https www.nerdfitness.com blog beginner body weight workout burn fat build muscle, thanks to a to zero off maester. Great suggestions. Hope people looking for motivation find it. That does it for my gold train, but you guys keep paying it forward. Happy holidays. Say nice things to the people around you. Even small ones, like thank you, well done, good job, etc. Edit, wow, first Reddit gold ever. Thank you so much, that's very kind of you. Been really depressed lately, I have always wanted to start a hobby where I could work with my hands. I decided to get into woodworking and my main goal is to build an arcade cabinet from scratch this upcoming year. I also started looking into getting more serious about hiking. Edit. Well thanks for all the comments. I actually made the decision last week and already purchased my first batch of tools. Drill impact driver set, circular saw and a jigsaw. I have a buddy who is experienced in woodworking kind of guiding me from afar since he lives in a different state. But I did find that her woodworking, wicked and riking to be very helpful. My first project is going to be building a pegboard for my garage and I'm really looking forward to it. To whoever needs it, put down that cigarette. You can do it. This random person believes in you. Cold turkey right now, let's go. Edit, I'm not and have never been a smoker, so I can't imagine how hard it is to quit. But I thought if I could give even one person a little push to give it up with my comment then that's worth it to me. Drink more water. Save a dollar for every time I'm negative. Maybe start with 10 cents and then gradually increase it to $1 or until you are cured of being overly negative or you have enough money saved from this to do something you've been really wanting to do. Set a schedule. It doesn't have to be set in stone but a general idea of how your day will go will help alleviate stress and anxiety. Don't worry about what other people think, if you do anything, do it for yourself. Set a sleep schedule and try to stick with it. Waking up at the same time every day was one of the best things I've started doing. Pick up a book. Read for fun. Read a book for at least 10 minutes a day. Edit. Wow, thanks for the gold. I'm a firm believer that anyone can love reading, they just have to find their genre. I'm currently working on Dostoyevsky's The Brothers Karamazov. But a few of my favorites are Austin Sense Sensibility, Emma, Pride Prejudice, Hawthorne's Scarlet Letter, and St. Exupery's Little Prince. I try to follow Aristotle's idea that it is the mark of an educated mind to be able to entertain a thought without accepting it. Read fun things, read hard things, but never make your reading list an echo chamber. Challenge your mind reward yourself with fun reads too. It'll grow your vocabulary, your ability to reason and your worldview. Steps off soapbox. Give five compliments a day and make them all different. Brightening up someone else's day is always a great way to boost your mood and confidence. Think positively. I really dislike my job, but I try to find the little things that make it not so bad, and it improves my mood tremendously. Hate waking up at 4.30 am? At least I get to see the sunrise at it. What do I do with gold lol? Call your loved ones, especially the ones who have loved you even through your shit times. Try to formulate a way you might be able to start letting go of past pain. Edit, omg, my first gold. Thank you kind stranger. Force yourself to look at things situations with reason and logic rather than knee-jerk emotional responses. Take deep, controlled breaths. Allocate time more directly to maintenance of my body and home, 
I lost 100 pounds this year. All due to diet. I could be a lot healthier if I added 30 minutes of exercise. Then there's my house. After I lost my wife I had a lot of trouble motivating myself to clean and now certain rooms are really needing it. If I could allocate even just an hour a day to it I would eventually be able to get back to regular maintenance rather than feeling helpless every time I open the door to one of those rooms. Lastly, reading. I desperately wanted to get back into it and I've succeeded a couple times and loved it. But college broke my spirit of habitual reading and I'm not sure how to get it back.